Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. Before you replace the drain tube in your refrigerator, be sure to unplug the power cord. You will need to pull the refrigerator away from the wall so you can access the rear of the appliance. To do this, use a Phillips head screwdriver to unthread the screws, securing the base grill. Pull the base grill forward to remove. Use a quarter inch socket or wrench to rotate the brake feet counterclockwise to raise them. You can now roll the refrigerator away from the wall. Use the quarter inch socket or a nut driver to unthread the screws to release the rear access panel. To access the drain tube mounting pin, you'll need to remove the condenser fan blade from the motor shaft. You can now use a flathead screwdriver to pry out the drain tube mounting pin. Pull the front of the old drain tube down to remove. Prepare the new drain tube for installation by transferring the mounting pin from the old tube to the new one. Now position the larger end of the tube over the grommet. Align the mounting pin and push it into place. Slide the condenser fan blade back onto the motor shaft. Reposition the access panel and rethread the screws. Once the refrigerator has been moved back into place, rotate the brake feet clockwise until both are in contact with the floor. Snap the base grill into place. Rethread the screws to secure the base grill. Plug the power cord back in and your refrigerator should be ready for use.